All right, YouTube. Uh, my name is Anthony Miller. If y'all don't already know, um, rapping type fitness. They call me rapping for short, cause I be rapping and also representing whatever you're representing. We're representing fitness over here. So this is rapping time fitness. Time is money, so I ain't gonna waste your time, even though you're not paying me a dime. Don't take a bite out of crime. No, that's ain't what we talk about this time. Yo, that was kind of bars though. But all jokes aside, all right. We got six days out until Mr. Olympia 2022. Who do y'all got with me? You got Breon Asley. You got uh, Chris Bumstead. You got all these other guys, right? You got Big Ramy in the uh, or Nick Walker in the open. Who you got? I don't know. Maybe you don't know. Maybe you don't care. Guess what? I don't even care. Why? Because I am a natural, all right? And I don't think they have a natural division. Yes, they got men's physique. They got classic physique, which is pretty much bodybuilding. But I was just saying, like, it's all bodybuilding. But men's physique, these guys look like bodybuilders now. Why? The elephant in the room. Bam! These people are juicing hard and heavy. All right? It's a stiff competition. There is money involved for the top guys. One of the top guys really getting paid, all right? The rest of them, they're pinning themselves with this gear and juice heads for nothing. Is it worth it? Is it worth that plastic trophy, all right? People always ask me why I don't compete. Because I'm natural. I wouldn't stand a chance. But I'm healthier than everybody on that stage. Yes, it's a personal choice before somebody say that. It is. But it's a selfish choice, all right? It ain't worth me not being here, all right? It's not worth me not being here for my family, all right? Do what you want to do. But if they had a, natu uh, a natural division where you can prove that somebody's truly natural, yes, there's people who can get past tests. Yes, there's going to be people who com com competed in Muscle Mayhem and Gymshark guys like that, they would be in there if there was a natural men's Olympia. But please, man, for those who are waiting on 2022 to get into fitness, to get into weight loss, understand that weight loss and bodybuilding are two different things, all right? A lot of people like to masquerade bodybuilding with fitness. Bodybuilding is not fitness. It's not health. When you're doing things that's unhealthy, then that's not health, all right? Hear it from me. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and let me show you why I'm not competing in men's Olympia. If they had a natural division, I'll show up, you know what I'm saying? I would show up if they had a natural division. I would show up, and I would show out. Them dudes ain't man enough to stay natural. They're not man enough. They're not man enough to stay natural, all right? Talk about Chris Bumstead. Everything come... Yo, no disrespect to Chris Bumstead or Brian Asley or Arnold Schwarzenegger or Rambo or any of those guys. The Rock. The Rock. The Rock. The Rock ain't even got abs, and I ain't even done yet. I'm 23 days out. I'm cutting for New Year's. I'm not cutting for the Olympia, all right? I'm not competing in the Olympia. I'm competing on this camera for Repetime Fitness, all right? So with that being said, if there was a natural Olympia, I will compete, all right? I'm not the, uh, the biggest natural in the world. But I guarantee you I can stand next to anybody who's really a natural, a truly lifetime natural, stand me next to any natural. And I guarantee you, yeah, repping time, boy, what? We healthy over here. We're bodybuilders, but we're healthy over here with it, yo. You know what I'm saying? Healthy, natural. I don't shoot them needles or take them pills. Come on, man. I'm still dangling. You feel me? Health is wealth, all right? Take care of yourself, all right? 
It ain't worth it. It's not. Rest in peace to everybody we lost. All jokes aside, this is not a joke. I'm trying to tell you the truth, but rest in peace to all we have lost. Look at what happens in bodybuilding, all right? It's your decision. It's a personal decision. Yes, it is. But I guarantee you, if they had a natural Olympia, I guarantee you, you ain't big like Big Walker, Nick Walker. He's not natural. Chris Bumstead, he's not natural. I'm not saying they're fake natties like the liver king. Of course, they they don't have to go out and say it. Of course, they can't just go out and say things like that. You know what I'm saying? For educational purposes only. This is uh, for educational purposes only, allegedly. All right? So guys like the liver king and fake charlatan um, influencers, things like that, they are going to be on you like wolves. Like flies on sugar rice. I'm telling you, they're going to be on you. This New Year's, be warned that I told you, Reppin' Time Fitness told you, watch out for supplement companies, watch out for gyms, watch out for fitness influencers, watch out for food in the store, watch out for restaurants. Everything's going to be geared towards getting your money this New Year's. They know. They seen it coming a mile away. They already got their plans planned out on how they going to get you. You ain't got to listen to me. I'm just some guy. I'm just some guy who lost 130 pounds, stayed muscular, stayed natural, stayed strong, stayed ripped. It ain't even done cutting yet. I got another few pounds to lose before New Year's. Come on, man, what you talking about? And I ain't even worked out yet. I just got off work. I just got off work. Yeah, I'm going go to bed, I'm going to eat dinner, and I'm going to wake up 2 o'clock in the morning. Y'all know what time I train. And I'm going to go in there. I'm 160 pounds. And I'm going to go in there and deadlift 500 pounds. I'm going to deadlift 500 pounds. And next time I bench press, you're going to see what I bench at this body weight. You're going to see what I squat at this body weight. I ain't a bodybuilder or a powerlifter because I don't compete, but I bodybuild and I lift like a powerlifter. Natural. Natural. 160, that's small. Do I look small to you? Yeah, you looking at the mass monsters who shoot needles up their butt, so yeah, I look small to you. Big Ramy twice my size. That boy 300 some pounds was on stage because of that needle. People talk about genetics this and genetics that. He wouldn't be nowhere near that size of, gen of genetics. Yeah, Rodney Coleman might have had crazy size if he was natural, but even him, all of them. Shout out to Rodney, Rodney Coleman, man. Hey, man. It's not worth it, man. It's not worth it. Arnold Schwarzenegger, shout out to Arnold Schwarzenegger. You ain't bigger than Arnold. Yeah, Arnold wasn't natural. Sylvester Stallone, not natural. The Rock, not natural. Oh, uh, who else? Honestly, I don't even think old boy from Creed is natural. Michael B. Jordan, I don't think he's natural. He might be. I don't know. A lot of these guys, they got incentives, man. There's millions of dollars on the line. Millions. It's not worth it, though, man. It's not. Comment, like, subscribe, and share. Click the link below to save 20% on Jockey Coffee. Also, click the link below to see my video, Hop the Top 10 Misconceptions and Lies that People Tell Y'all About Weight Loss, Fitness, All of This. The industry is full of that BS. So go ahead, listen to me, or listen to them. Which one are you going to choose? Natty or not? Natty or not? Pardon my back, Chris Bumstead. <laughs> Pardon my back, Chris Bumstead, bruh. You know my level, son. Pardon my back double biceps. 